So, how's it going guys? This is Dominic Morris and today is the first in a series of three Sonic Screwdriver Set reviews. Now, as you know, I'm a bit of a Doctor Who fan, so reviewing screwdrivers is kind of a common thing that I do. I might go through every single one of my screwdrivers and review them individually one day, I'll get to that. But for now I'm going to start with this one. Now obviously, toy production had come a long way since Doctor Who started back in 1963. And the most logical step forward for Doctor Who restarting was merch. Toys. A child audience. And of course, Sonic Screwdriver made a return. Leading to this. <laughs> the Doctor Who 2005 Sonic Screwdriver. Yes, I have the box for this. No, I have not had it since 05. <laughs> now, the funny thing was, I picked this up on eBay for 50, 40, 50 quid, I think it was. So, it's still on the box and everything, all the bits. And it still works, which is amazing. So, if we take a look on the front, obviously, you got the Doctor logo, um, which weirdly is not the one they used in 2005, so it makes me wonder if this was released after the fact. Uh, you also got that one, which is Sonic Screwed Up, BBC, and Character Options. There we go. Um, highly detailed, authentic replica, list of things, list of bits. And of course, Christopher Eccleston holding said screwdriver. Now, I think the package shows the screwdriver off alright. You know, you can see the neck section, the button, part of the bit. I never understood what that notepad was for. You can see he later switched it. I shall see one of my later reviews. They switched it for the um, uh, the um, psyche paper. Don't know what that was about. But anyway, I reckon. No one even says it's age six plus. I could operate this thing. But anyway, guys. Um, without further ado, let's open this up and see what it's like. Alrighty, so here we have the screwdriver. Um, now inside the packet you get this notepad, which has about 30 sheets of paper in it. An instruction booklet. The instruction booklet is actually something we haven't seen for a long time. Look at that. That's impressive. Um, you also get a nib. And the screwdriver itself. Now, considering this was made in 2005 in the early days, it didn't do too bad. You probably can't see it on here, but the grainy quality, if I can pull up that one. There we go. Got a comparison. So this is a more recent um, screwdriver. You know, cracking, very visible, buttons a bit flatter. And lights blue. But considering this is 2005, I think they did all right. So, it can be operated and opened and closed. Uh, the buttons on the side, which have been a common place for ninth and 10th Doctor screwdrivers over the years. Um, this is one with a UV light, so... I feel like that gives a more authentic screwdriver glow. And like I said, you can operate it in open mode 2. Which is alright. Um, the bottom I have on the end of this I think it's a UV one. Yeah. That's a UV one. Which works with the pad. I won't demonstrate that because it doesn't work very well. Which isn't great. But simply remove the nib you just pull it off. <laughs> And you just slack in the other one. That's the pen one. There we go. The pen one is the one that comes separate when you get it initially. So, yeah. Um, if you're wondering how to get it open, you simply 
there's the screw, you just unscrew that, you take the thing out, and you replace the batteries, the batteries on the inside of the screwdriver. So yeah, that's pretty simple. Um, I'll be honest, this screwdriver is one I never had. The one I had was always the tenth one, which is pretty similar, you know, same concept. Um, and like I said, as you'll see, the screwdrivers developed over time, the cracking became more noticeable, the design got a bit better, the stuff got cooler. But then, uh, yeah, that's my review of the 9th Doctor Sonic Screwdriver. Um, I think at some point my both my 10 screwdrivers should be coming at some point, I don't know when. So we'll see. Uh, but anyway guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.